Hi, welcome to another in the series of Max's Masterclass Driver Training videos. Um, we're going to be looking at uh, the changes that they've made to small thorn roundabouts. Um, some time ago they put some cobbles around the outside of the uh, roundabouts and now they've changed some of the lane markings as well. So we're just uh, proceeding up Sneed Hill. Um, this is obviously very near the Cobridge Test Centre and it might be uh, a route that you get on your driving test. Uh, we're going to be approaching the <coughs> first of the roundabouts from Sneed Hill and we're going to be turning left at the first roundabout and then we're going to proceed straight ahead at the next two roundabouts. We do need to be in the right hand lane to proceed across the other two roundabouts. So we've entered here in the left hand lane, we're just stopping behind the pedestrian crossing because our exit road is, uh, is blocked. So we're just waiting for this other car to clear and we shall move up to the roundabout. We're looking to our right and we're also looking to see if anyone's turning right and it's okay it's clear to go so we proceed into the right hand lane again our exit road is blocked so we don't want to go over the pedestrian crossing until it's clear we're looking to the right to see if there's any vehicles coming from the right or vehicles turning from the right it's clear for us to go and now we're going to go straight ahead at the next roundabout it's clear to our right and we're just following the road markings round. So that's how to proceed across small thorn roundabouts coming from Sneed Hill. Uh, we're going to be having a look at in the next couple of videos at approaching those roundabouts from another direction. So we'll see you in a minute.